Good morning and buongiorno and welcome to Building in Bradford. I'm at Bradford's very own specialty coffee roasters, Cassie Espresso, and they invited me to look behind the scenes. Cassie Espresso, tell us about it. Yeah, so basically the business started about in 2000 by my dad, Tony. Uh, we started mainly as a coffee machine supplier, supplying Italian restaurants and coffee shops around Bradford. And then over the years, we introduced a few new products and services. Um, unfortunately, passed away by the end of 2006. Uh, and that's when I took over the business. And then about four years ago, we started to roast our own coffee. So see some coffee being roasted. Absolutely, come on. Our team. This is Johnny. How, How are we doing, roast? Johnny? Not very nice to meet you. Okay. Thank you. Matthew at the roast at the moment. Hello, Matthew. Hello. You all right? Hello. Busy. He's busy roasting. <laughs> We're behind the scenes now at Cassie Espresso in the roast. What do you call it? The roastery? Is that yeah, what you the roastery. Roast yeah, yeah. We go from places all around the world, really. So, we start off, we've got some Sumatra here, which is from Indonesia. That one there, from Indonesia? Yeah, Indonesia, right. all the way from there. Uh, Nicaragua, Central Americas. Brazil, South America. Wait, how many sacks of coffee do you get, what, per, per month? Uh, per month, I'd probably say around about 12 to 15 sacks of coffee we go through. And they're roughly 60 to 70 kilo bags. 60 70 kilo yeah, bags, that's, that's a lot of coffee. Right. Which one do you want to roast today? Which one do you want to show us? We're roasting this morning from Brazil, because right. we use a lot of that in our blends. So that's how coffee, when it gets delivered, yeah, like that? that's raw coffee, that's the green raw coffee. So a lot of the flavour comes out of the actual roasting of the coffee. So from there, it goes into uh, the roaster. Yep, yeah, it goes into the top of the roaster here. We've got a drum inside here, which is, sort of looks a little bit like a washing machine, really. Yep. Uh, it's got fins on the inside that keep the coffee agitated all the time. Uh, that's spinning around whilst the burner inside is producing heat. It takes a lot of heat to get it up to what it needs to be. Roughly, it'll be in for about 10 minutes. Yep. At this point, we're just over five minutes in. That colour's going to change as we're going through, and all that colour change is caramelisation. Literally, yeah. the sack from Brazil. <laughs> Into the roaster. Yeah. You've added no flavours or anything like that. Nothing like that, no. no. And just with heat. Just heat. Heat is just changing the colour, flavour, running through the taste of that bean. Exactly. That. If you do longer, it'll be smoother. Is that what you're saying? Essentially, yeah. So am I going to release the beans? Is that is that right? You're, you're going to release the beans. I mean the colour, look at the colour, the smell though, the smell is unbelievable. Definitely has that chocolate smell, caramel smell. There we go. These are going to come out now. What, we're 10 minutes now, 12 minutes? Quickest process ever. So from the bag, the roaster to the cup, let's go have a cup of coffee. The moment of truth, it's a tasting experience now. The technique is to slurp as loud as you can. So I'll take the lead and show you exactly what you can do. We'll get a little bit on the spoon. Slurp as loud as you can. First one, we normally take two slurps. Um, sort of some of the more chocolatey you notes know, that are going on in there. But as they cool, you'll find that you get more sort of intense. And right. Oh and my god. He's a cheap slurp for you, are you? <laughs> This is the espresso blend. Oh, why can't I slurp? So polite. <laughs> so polite. Thank you so much for inviting us down, Nino. No, thank you. Matt, Johnny, Cassie Espresso. If you want to check them out, social media, on the website. Or in fact, come on down and come and try a delicious coffee.